going on an adventure to Frostvelor. Hopefully we won't get killed by Dredge. So we started here, and we're going there. Uh, now there. Yeah, there. Nifty map. The map is so great. Should we rest, or should we trek on? We have Our morale, morale kind of sucks. We only have nine days of supplies. How many days did it take us to get here from Skoger? Two? We're only halfway. I So we don't know. We got those extra supplies, though, remember? Because we saw the travelers. So we've been on the road for a little while. Maybe rest for a day. Do it! Our morale still sucks. Let's do it. Alright. Alright. Uh, uh. <laughs> yes! <laughs> These guys. Just outside the village when two men in red approach. My name is Hogan, says one, gesturing to the other. My brother is Mogan. Hugh, get a and come on. Uh, many from the village wish to join you to Frostvillar, a third man, exchanging, uh, exuding rage. rage. Shut your mouth! There was a Burning Wheel game that we all just recently played, and uh, one of my characters, the character I played, Ellie, was looking to try and find people to like join up with us. Uh. And the two NPCs were uh, Hagger and Hoger. <laughs> and they were basically these guys. Nice. I was really excited. I married one of them at the end, which was kind of fun. Nice. Yeah. Bastards don't speak for us. They've been trying to divide the village since you got here. That guy's face is messed up. True. You can keep whoever wants to stay and die. The rest of us will go with the reasonable people of Skoger. These guys are so hot. <laughs> well, I'm both good before I let the village have the village desert. Behind the, uh, the angry villager, a mob of armed thugs has appeared and furrowed brows and nervous stares. You both know what will happen to the rest of us if the fields are abandoned. Nobody leaves. Mm. Won't be anything to tend once the dredge arrive. Let your people decide on their own. I don't want anything to do with this. Say nothing. We gotta try and convince them to come with us. I would us. say there won't be anything left. Nope. Dredge my ass! What a dumb fuck. You dumb, son. <laughs> you dumb. I don't know what the skim is this time, Hogan, but you got two choices. Get back to work or I'm finally putting you in the ground. Mogan, what do you say? Thought it was unfair that he only asked me. <laughs> Uh-oh. Draws the axe slowly. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I, I think I make a poor farmer. with us it's probably that but I, I mean but we also don't, don't want to kill, kill villagers, villagers so then let's just not get involved yeah. and step back as one of the thugs lunges forward and is caught in the ribs by Hogan's axe the air soon rings with the sound of screams and axe heads against shields four men lie dead on the ground before the others run you hurt no we should have done that years ago nah I can't go around killing people for no good reason this is a good reason <laughs> I like that logic. Brothers head back into the village, and soon many of the villagers have joined your caravan. Hogan introduces you to his young son and wife. All grins, unconcerned about the fact that you never agree to let them come. You don't bother arguing. Before long, you set out again. I mean, we pro- 84 clansmen, 11 fighters. All right. Supplies. Hey! Okay, good. I was like, they better not all, right. all our supplies. Let marches quietly alongside the caravan a little distance since leaving the village. When you stop for a rest, I'll leave a prize you both. Approaches? <laughs> One day. Let, I have something for you. <laughs> she got <gathers laughs> Shut up, Jack! Focus! This is important! I love it. Uh, so it's a banner. What's this about? I was hoping you'd sew up the banner with everything that has happened since we left Skogar. Come find me another time, Rook, and we'll talk. Before you can comment, she departs. Dad, are you the chieftain now? We gotta, like, be the guy. We gotta... Looks that it's way. It's gotta be that way. We gotta step it up. We gotta be there. Yeah, they still... They don't, like, give you the choice to be the confident leader. They just make you, like... We'll be, like... You think anybody oh. in this type of situation is going to be like, yeah, no, for sure. I got this. I'll do it. No. It's freaky. Uh, Odd Leaf has been teaching me how to sew. 
She speaks pretty highly of you. Can we read the part about mom? <sighs> the banner has been sewn. The story of the families who have lived in Skogor throughout the years. Just as is done in every banner and in every town. I wish we were here, but I'm kind of glad she isn't. The section about your family is short, but Alette has been sewing in colorful designs. Dwan. Why do you say that? So she doesn't have to deal with all of this. The dredge, leaving home, and... Why didn't you stop those men from killing each other in the village? Oh, so that's what's bothering you. I mean, if it's okay to ask... It was the best of some bad options? I didn't want... Wasn't blind. my decision? But we're gonna have to make tough decisions. Eventually... That was a pretty tough one, but they figured it out. I mean, this is kind of what our logic was, I right? think so. Yeah, it was the best. Yeah. Deciding what happens to other people? I'm glad I'm not you. I wouldn't know what to do. It's not exactly my calling either. Yeah, I know. Thanks a lot for the support, <laughs> Let. Dad. She hugs you. You spend the rest of the time together sewing new verses into the banner. For better or worse, the story of Skoger is your burden now. Alright, that was the moment of, like, alright, I'm the leader. It's done. And it's done. Oh, yeah, we're gonna talk to Oddly if we don't have anything to do with heroes. Let's we just go talk to him. Yeah, let's just do that. We could probably stand to rest a day or two. How are you doing, Odd? Such a str- I'm alright. <laughs> nah, uh, bad at first. <laughs> Sometimes when a loved one dies, people say it doesn't sink in for a while. Sunk in for me right away. People tell me I'm a strong woman. It's funny, my father named me Oddly before I was even born. He wanted a boy so badly. Strong woman. What does that even mean? Yeah, girl. I never cared for that expression. It means you're going to be okay. People look up to you. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I've gotten that one a lot in this past year. It's like, you're a really strong woman. I'm like, I don't even know what, um, that I keep it together? I guess that, that's just How about a strong person? That's just being a human. Yeah. Strong human. Kind of like I never cared for that expression. Yeah, let's just, do it. Let's just do that. Because that makes us cool. If I feel nothing about my husband dying, people think I'm strong. If I cry because my insides feel like they're on fire, I'm weak. Why does that feel so backwards? Way to call out. Uh, Boom. <laughs> well done. Some feminism up in here. <laughs> 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 All right. I'm sorry, Rook. It's been hard. You're not sure what to say. In the many years you've known the chieftain's wife, this is probably the most you've ever talked. Uh, you asked me to come find you? Yes. It's about the banner. I thought about it a long time. He asked me to give it to you, you know, if something happened. Why me? Your family? You should carry it. What, what would, would you, you have done? done? Yeah, yeah, let's ask her. Get some console. That's what I've been thinking about so much. It should be mine. I could carry it. But I thought about why he named you. I get it. They won't follow a woman. Families would leave. Our banner would be divided. Bullshit. I hate this. I think they would follow you or I would vouch for it. Well, psh, she don't need a man to follow She don't her. need you. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably right because the world sucks. Hmm, uh, cop out. <laughs> no, don't cop out. I think they would I follow you. Yeah. Follow you. Come on, Rook. This isn't time for pretend. It's not just about our small town. What happens the first time we need something from another clan? How will that go? And the first time someone thinks they can take advantage of us? I think this is what has to happen. Man. What was that hashtag on Facebook? Oh, why I need feminism? Yes. This. Boom. Boom. Uh, maybe this is what is... It means to be a strong woman. I'll do my best. I'll rely on you. I'll rely on you. I'll be there when I can. Just don't expect any miracles. Eh. Listen, I know <laughs> I dragged this out. The truth is, my husband and I can never have a child. Sad. I don't want our banner to end here. It'll be safe with you and Alette. I know you're going to take care of her. She puts her hand on your shoulder as she heads back into the camp. Bye for now. Yes. We did it. We're doing well. <laughs> We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. Where are we? We're doing oh, it, no, Peter. We are. Where's the map? Uh, no map. Um, no map. I guess not. 
All Do you right. want to rest for a day or two? Uh, rest. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We can go okay. now. Yeah. Just want. Just That's normal all we needed. morale. Just don't want to be depressed. Nope. Oh, we can make camp at any time now. Nice. At a small split in the trail, a few fighters stop to speak with you, each carrying a single pack. We recognize this place, one man says. Spent several years here with some kin. If they're still around, we'll have to warn them of what's coming. With luck, we'll find you again in less than a week. See them off with extra supplies, just in case. Probably. We gotta take care of them. They might come back. Yep, that's the way we're playing. <laughs> yep! If that's all you're, at, you're t taking... <laughs> You may never make it. Uh, grabbing a few items from the supply wagon, you strap the additional provisions to their backs. Search for your family instead of food. There you go. Eight fighters. Only three supplies. We got a lot of renown, though. That's really good. Yeah, yeah we're good. Crummy not Ramelian. surprised. <sighs> eh? Or mandarins don't even water. Banner from camp, because he's gonna get it anyway. Banner from camping to your others in the future. Okay. Punish him physically? I don't think that's. Eh. No, we're not gonna do that. That's not an this option. One. Yep. You'll rest and drink away from everyone until you learn to control yourself. You tell the man. The caravan approves of your decision until it arrives at to Spears one evening. We finally found him it's as a corpse at the bottom of a steep ravine. He must have stumbled into it. He was a nuisance, but nobody wanted to see it end like this. Sad. <sighs> Way to go, dude. Well, hey! Right there, we made it! Survived! With extra what? fighters. What? strong, thriving city. The walls of Frostvetter now just keep the howling winds at bay. With luck, they'll hold out against dredge as well. Oh, our morale sucks. <laughs> at least we're here. Yeah, thank goodness. All right, we'll figure out what Frostvetter has waiting for us when we get here uh, next time. See you in Frostvetter. Frost Valor? Who knows? <laughs> <laughs>